Good morning, my name is Helen. I will be your CNA student for today. I'm going to assist you in a, a indwelling catheter or Foley catheter care. Is that okay with you, Mrs. Green? Okay, I'm going to bring my supplies, wash my hands, and I'll be right back. But before I leave, here you go the whole lights just in case you need anything. Let's see where is this whole lights. The time this coil lines should be on the bridge. Here you go. I'm going to bring my supplies. My supplies will be two washcloths, this one, two washcloths, two towels, water basin, and soap. These are the supplies. I am back and should gloves. I am back. I'm gonna put the bed up for my body mechanic. Rail down on my working side. I don't have to do it unless if we have the second rail in here. Other way, we are okay working on here on this side for the patient. Uh, lock the bed wheels. Make sure the, the bed wheels are locked. Privacy, pull the curtain for privacy. I wash my hands and I'm going to put the gloves on. This requires gloves. This procedure requires gloves because you touch the body secretion. How often we clean that catheter? We clean one time with the complete bed bath in the morning and any time when you change the diaper and this the soil or they have stool, you have to clean it. I brought it in here water. Is this water good for you? This is green. Okay, she said okay. I'm gonna expose only the part what I should take care for. This is a male, and we have a fully catheter inside the ureter, which is not inside in here, but we pretend that it's all right, like this. Okay, how do I clean? I probably use the two towels in here, one to cover in here, and the other one to cover in here to keep the patient warm. I will take and put the soap in here, warm it up, and do like this. And how do you do to clean the this? indwelling catheter or foley catheter is the name you put your finger in here you hold it the catheter in a place because what you want to do you want to wash from in out they say four inches but you can wash as long you need it in here as far you need it like this and you can turn the other side three times you can do three times one two three Okay, wash, soap in water, okay. After that, you hang this one in here and you rinse. The same thing. You hold the Foley catheter in a place in here. If it's a woman, you just put it the uh, finger as deep you can to hold it. Do not pull the Foley catheter out from the bladder. And you do, you hold it in here. One, that means from in here, it, this this is considered the cleanest part. You don't do the other way to bring the the bacteria towards to the urethra, which goes to right to the kidneys and to the bladder. Second one, and you do the third one, like when we do female care. And after that, you can pat it dry. The same thing from in and out. Okay, the other side, and you can use the other side of the towel. Okay, we finish with this one, the Foley catheter, clean the Foley catheter. The Foley catheter is hooked up in here, connected with the tubing, which the tube goes to the uh, bed, this is the, the bed bag. Why they say bed bag? Because the people, they use this bed bag when they are in a bed. When they are out, 
they use leg back. They replace it with the leg back. But this bed back, remember, all the time should be hung by the bed frame. This is the bed frame, not the bed rail. Never at the bed rail. Because if you put it in here on the bed rail, when you put the rail down, you are gonna pull the catheter out. That means this leg bag, uh, no, uh, bed bag, I'm sorry, should be hooked up by the bed frame, okay? And the urine is gonna drainage from the bladder inside that bag. Also for the good drainage, which most of the people they might not know, they leave this one like this. For the better drainage, this should be like this in a bed, like a bowl. And that way they have this clip on in here. You clip this one in here somewhere on the sheet to stay like this, to stay in here. This should be to stay in here like this because if it's this way, the urine drainage better than if it's straight. Um, I am uh, done. Are you comfortable, Mrs. Green? This goes to the laundry. You can see this goes to the laundry. They put it here. The fully catheter is patent. Patent means you look to, to see if you have any urine coming out in a tubing. If you don't have urine coming out, means this end of the indwelling catheter or fully catheter is clogged with some sediments blood or pus and what we should do but this is a nurse job is gonna uh, do disconnect from here and use a big syringe and irrigate the bladder is the name but this is not the cna job but you might want to know and um, this one you might want to know because you might assist the nurse to do that as a cna this they put it a little syringe to inflate the balloon after they insert it in a bladder, this Foley catheter, they insert it in a bladder. And after they insert it, they put the uh, liquid or air in here and the balloon is coming on. If you want to, I can show you. From here, you hold the catheter inside in here, inside the urethra. You put your finger in here, hold it, and you wash it like this from here down, here down because you don't want to pull the catheter out from the bladder. That is very important. Very important skill for the CNAs to know to do this one because sometimes they, they pull the catheter out. Close procedure now. Uh, I'm done, Mrs. Green. Uh, are you comfortable? I finish, are you comfortable? Here you got the four lights. I uh, am gonna put the bed down, rail up. Lock the bed wheels, open the curtain for privacy, and I will dispose this in the laundry. This get washed and put it in designated place. And the last things is remove my gloves. This is the way. Trash somewhere should be the trash. I wash my hands, report and chart, patient tolerated the procedure well, or because we did the washing, we can say uh, patient skin intact. There is no redness, no ab ab abrasion or something, open wound, because they might have open wound in there, okay? And this is not board exam, but this is for you to know to do it as a CNN.